Hello, it's the uh, 21st of April and uh, here at J&A Muffins. Today, the uh, both of these litters we're going to talk about just got moved to the big box and you can see they're very happy to uh, have gotten out of their, li their little nursing boxes and get a little bit more freedom but uh so we've both of these litters were born just a few days apart they're around five weeks old um we've got from our march madness litter we have two babies they're both boys this one is right now anyways the bigger of the two boys and his name is the duke blue devils and then we have our other little boy with the white tipped ears and he's the Wisconsin Badgers after the the final four March Madness but that makes our 13th and 14th kittens that we have on the ground which was uh, not in the plans but sometimes that's what happens but they're both very very beautiful um, we think that we're pretty sure they're gonna be uh, natural minks and so their colors will get a little bit darker as they get older and then all the other little babies you see running around those are from our uh, seven little dwarfs there's seven of them and we'll see if we can go through here and identify each one of them there's the two cream minks right there the one on the right is uh, let me let Doc and the one on the left is Grumpy. So, not that that has anything to do with his attitude, but this is Doc. Say hi. And then we got Grumpy. Hi there. Hey, Grumpy, look up. He's not going to be helpful and look up. <laughs> but they're both cream minks and they will get. Uh, much darker orange as their color develops they look like they're gonna have a lot of color I never tell how much is coming through on the video but they look uh, you can start to see their color coming in as they used to be almost pure white then those two are boys and each over here is our other little boy oh, and his name is Dobie Yes, that's you. And he's not dopey at all. He's he is just a a cute little boy, and uh, he's a natural mink also. And then let's see who else we got. They all playing over here in the box. <laughs> okay, the the one in the corner there, and I can tell her real easy. She's a natural mink with white. She's got more white. If she, if they move, she's got a white band on her back. Um, and her name is Sneezy. Yes, little Miss Sneezy. She's one of our girls. And then we got Happy over here, who looks more like she's scared than happy. But, uh, I say this is all a new experience for him. She was just running around and playing like crazy before I started videoing. I mean, now she's kind of not so sure about herself. And then we've got right here in front of me walking around. This one is bashful. Okay, I guess we got these two backwards. <laughs> yeah. But... <laughs> I say has nothing really to do with their personalities. We just was naming them after the seven dwarfs because there's several uh, seven of them. And then back in the box in the corner, she's got white tipped ears and a stripe down her nose. That is sleepy. So, and uh, all of those girls we think are natural minks. 
They're a little different color than the two boys from the other litter, but uh, some, sometimes uh, they look like natural minks when they're born and they end up being blue minks. One of our mommies is like that, so, um, but we're pretty sure they're natural minks. But there's, I'm not going to try to go through names again because i got to really look hard to figure it out. <laughs> but um, There's those three. And then we got the two in the box. And then let's see over here. We've got two in the corner. And then we got the two cream boys, which are right in the light and you can't see nothing. <laughs> but anyways that's our uh, you know, March Madness and our seven little dwarfs and there's one of the mommies of the uh, March Madness litter and I said their first day out in the big box getting to play and have fun we'll do another video shortly bye